Though The Twilight Zone has never been a stranger to tackling weighty social themes, one episode handled its subject matter in such a way that led to it being pulled from syndication by CBS for over 50 years. The episode in question is Season 5's The Encounter, a story of wartime trauma, suppressed prejudice, and racial disharmony. The episode's apparent good intentions in portraying the consequences of racism were mostly undermined by its mishandling of the same theme. There's plenty that The Encounter does right, namely its method of portraying the lasting effects that subtle acts of racism have upon society. The problem, though, and the reason why civil liberties groups found the episode harmful, is that it fails at presenting a fair portrayal of main character Arthur and the Asian American demographic he was meant to represent. The episode is terrifying in a way that many Twilight Zone entries are. It's a horrific examination of man's folly and the ugliness that hides beneath the surface of American society and human nature. The problem is that, especially for the time, the episode makes narrative choices that only add to the idiotic racist beliefs that it meant to condemn. Airing only 20 years after the US's incarceration and forceful relocation of massive numbers of Japanese Americans into internment camps during World War II, Twilight Zone's The Encounter ultimately stumbles over itself while portraying its character of Arthur Takamori. On one hand, this blatant portrayal of racial disharmony assuredly proved to be a provoking, uncomfortable experience for viewers of the horror anthology, but that isn't the problem. The issue comes near the start of the third act, when Arthur reluctantly admits that his father, a Japanese-American man working construction on Pearl Harbor at the time of the Imperial Navy's attack, was actually a spy who gave the planes directions on where to attack. This only feeds into the absurd and baseless assumption that those of non-European ethnicities are naturally less inclined to be good Americans. It's an unfortunate twist in Martin Goldsmith's otherwise poignant script that ultimately led to the episode's removal from syndication. Even as a product of a less inclusive era, The Encounter should have done better. Under developing its Asian American character and feeding into harmful stereotypes goes against what you'd expect from The Twilight Zone. Had the episode handled its subject matter better, it could have been among the best and scariest episodes of The Twilight Zone. In dealing with the weighty, timely themes of war trauma and the perpetually harmful consequences of even minor acts of racism, the episode was close to coming up with something spectacular. The episode understands, as the best Twilight Zone entries do, not only that there's a social problem, but also a solution. Only it stumbles and falls flat on its face, an unfortunate misstep in an otherwise impressive attempt. 